Hello, 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 hello. What's going on, everybody? How about Minecraft? Do we play Minecraft? Look, I have a, I have a potato. I have a potato in my hand. Let me turn on the green screen. <laughs> oh my gosh! Just want to know what a flipper snapper is? It's, it's like a fan. It's like, I don't know, cool stuff. I don't know. It's fine. Yeah, just uh, what's Minecraft? It's I don't know. It's this thing. I don't meh, stuff. Got Enderbutt in his house. Enderbutt, hi, how you doing, buddy? Good, to, good to see you. How you doing? Yep. Mhm. Mm there you go. Looking, uh, looking. You might want to do some squats, bud. Uh, anyways, what I wanted to do today for a little while here is uh, we can. That's an iron pick. Is I want to build a new diamond pick. I want to get to level thirty and do some enchanting at Thanks some so point. Much. But I don't want to sit at the skeleton spawner and just live at a skeleton spawner because that sounds boring. So first and foremost, because we didn't do it last time and I desperately need to is we're gonna go do a little bit more tree choppage action today. I got this, I gotta, I gotta show it to y'all. I did some testing and a creative thing for a future plan, but people who have been sending things like crazy in the flip series suggestions, if you're a Twitch sub, join the channel over on the Discord, but check this out right here. I tried making that boat. I tried making the boat that you had sent and I think it turned out, I think it turned out quite cool. I think this is kind of a cool little steamboat type thing. Isn't this thing sick? I thought I've never used crimson wood before, but I we're going to build this at some point in the near future. I don't know when it'll happen, but it's going to happen. I was going to put it in the little dock area that we have in there in front of the brewery, but it's too big and it blocked the entire building. So we can't do it there. We need something flatter. I think we're just going to have a storage barge with some little boat that can pull it out. But yeah, so I want to show that to y'all. It's so cool. I came up with that design last night while I was just messing around. I haven't figured out how I want to do this yet because we don't have a whole lot of land space. But I want to somehow have, you know those old timey? I got this because I've been playing um, Anno 1800. Uh, Lucas, if you're in here on Wednesday's stream, Lucas was like, Hey, just so you know, Anno 1800 is actually on sale on Humble Bundle right now. Well, I bought it. Um... And since Wednesday, I've logged almost 10 hours in the game. <laughs> so, that's not good. <laughs> it's been really fun, but yeah, I've just been playing that game like crazy. And what I found in it was they have these cool old-timey, like, industrial-looking systems for, like, bringing ores out of the earth. Um, where it's, like, buckets that going up on a big conveyor belt. They go up and they go to the top and drop it over, and then they go back to the next, like, the big loops. Like, really tall little, like, a loop thing. And I want to build some of those as a way to like get things out of a mine. But anyways, I've got a lot of ideas about stuff to do. But we're at the point in this world right now where um, I need resources. I need blocks to build with. So I think the next few videos that we're going to be doing are going to be about getting some functional stuff set up. I want to just have a little bit more at my disposal. Right now, it's, it's a little rough. Show doing everything um i'm constantly having to go gather uh rocks out of the ground constantly having to go break um trees like we've been doing every stream in order to get anything uh so i think we can at least like get like an iron farm stuff set up and everything like that uh i think so safe safe space the spruce trees won't grow because they're so close together the guys over here Thanks a lot. these big guys yeah they will if you put them like at a slight angle like that you can actually get them to grow together you just don't get as many leaves I also need to grab a bunch of andesite today. I'm out of andesite, which is a weird thing to have a problem with. So we're gonna kind of just do a bit of mining on camera. <laughs> That's what it is, I'm not bitter. Um, and we'll go from there. And then I think we might do a little bit of building today. I'm really tempted to see if we can come up with a design for something above the skeleton spawner. That would be really fun. The comments were torn between doing some people said lighthouse, some people said giant skeleton skull, and a lot of people said that I should have like a ruined boat, like a shipwreck or a crashed airship or something along those lines. So I like the idea of the crashed airship or the crashed boat of something, like a shipwreck of just something over there, which I thought could be really fun. So we're going to work on that today. I thought it'd be kind of cool to just do a little bit of building. I'm crazy. I do want to start adding some more stuff. 
around to show like we have that design of the nether portal and everything i want to start adding new stuff like that around there like shows like an old ancient civilization that like the new steampunk city is building on the top of i absolutely love to retweet and comment on people who make fan art and stuff like that for like what i'm doing because the fact that you all would spend time to do that i think is amazing so i just love to be able to share that with the rest of the community where i can my just area up here is just disgusting it's so bad everything is so so bad i added barrels in the floor to get more storage everybody i added barrels into the floor in the kitchen just to have more storage space <laughs> what's the next build i'm planning on doing um today we're gonna work on the little lighthouse ruined boat structure above the skeleton spawner so we'll do that today and outside of that i haven't really figured it out yet i wanted to talk to you all a little bit as we're working through uh stream projects today of what we're building about what we should do with the base because <laughs> right now i've got an idea that i want to move forward with for like a next build of like i i basically i just need to sit down and figure out like where we're gonna put a villager breeder where we're gonna put some farms where we're gonna do those things and just stuff all over the place like it's gonna be it's gonna take a little bit of time to get figured out but it's something pretty important to do favorite biome uh i really like mega i think i think minecraft can learn a lot like as like the game can learn a lot from how they did mega tigers purely on the grounds of there's so many different types of ground foliage and ground coverage being podzol coarse dirt grass regular dirt all that stuff on the ground is really cool to see and then there's so many different types of trees having big mega spruce trees having the regular spruce trees and then also on top of that there's even more when you look at like there's it's the only biome in all of minecraft that has rocks it has rocks why do no why do rocks not exist in minecraft outside of one biome like the mossy co cobblestone boulders are so nice so so very nice to have and i would love to be able to see more of that type of stuff throughout the game just we're going for a steampunk style so there's like gears and things all over the place just random stuff sticking out of the sides of the walls and just things turning and just having different weird things going I, it's, it's gonna be looking very technical because i can't do any redstone in minecraft so if i can make it look like there's technical things going on then people might think i'm smart i don't know that's the plan that was enough block gathering that we need for the next little while probably to be honest uh do we want to start building up this thing here or do we want to try and make the cliff over here look a little nicer the cliff I, I i think i'm ready for the cliff i think i we haven't done any really terraforming based things so we can do the cliff and let's work on that beach over there let's work on the edge of the water make that look all nice and fancied up we need dead coral though Pleased we need some you. dead coral so we'll have to go really set it up and then we'll go out and get some other stuff cozy. uh we're gonna get rid of this guy and do some of these something like this what we're gonna start with here is just cleaning it up so it's not so much just stone everywhere or not so much just dirt everywhere i want to have be a little bit cleaner so we can have some more stone and work on the shape a little bit better especially over here where we have all this sand i think a lot of this is gonna have to go but that's fine uh, let's do like that and then we can have like a little guy right in here let's do some of the dirt and then we can actually have maybe the stone giving i want to have like a little bit of greenery in the area so we can just do like the stone kind of coming down around this way it's like this we can do one of those guys We can have like that little bit of green and we can have some more dirt right over in here like that and then here we can have like i don't know we'll we'll figure this out as we're going here but i think something like that and then we can bring the stone down here a little bit further and then we'll probably extend the sand out a bit to have a cool little sandy beachy area and it should be pretty good i feel like in this section that we have here with this sand sticking out that almost makes me want to make some stone like come a little bit of like an archway sticking out of here what do we think about that 
I think we're gonna try it. So we can have like this. Cause then the, the sand, we have the floating sand here, which we probably won't keep unfortunately because we're gonna have to tweak things around. But we can keep the idea of the floating sand. Huh, 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 still giving it some credit. So we take this and bring it back like boop, boop. And then we can have this kind of coming down over here. Figure out the rest Why of that face here soon. Will we do something like this where it just kind of extends out to this corner here? I'm thinking it could work. I don't know about you all, but I think it could work. We can bring some coarse dirt out here too to get the edge a little bit more disrupted. Mm-hmm. Do a little bit of good old dithering, as they might say. Thinking at this point we can have a slab. A lot. We can have another slab. We have a oh no, stair needs to go the other way. Actually, we'll do a full block right there, and we can have a slab right there. That could work out. Let's do this. Clean that edge up there. Just, just, just a little. Just a little bit. And that's coming down this way. We can do like this. What if we did boop, boop, boop? Yeah, I think that'll be okay. Yeah, perfect. What is that? Is that a slab? It is. Okay, so we'll go up here, do a stair so it's not a copy. Do that. We can do full block, full block, full block. Do a stair. And I would love to do a little slab guy right in there. Get him all the way out. Temporary dirt to blockies. Get rid of those. And we could do this with a slab. Look at that though. I kinda I'm kinda digging that. It looks pretty sweet. I think this little guy right here is messing with my brain a bit, but. I think the way we can fix it is by doing this and that, because then it gives a little bit more width to it. And this is where we can start having some fun, woo, because we weren't having fun yet. No fun was allowed. Now we got to have fun. Mandatory fun time. Actually, we'll keep this kelp. Um, this is where I want to go get some. We might tweak some of these things as we're going uh, or go get some. I want to go get some dead coral and just well, corals in general here soon so we can work with some of it. But for now, we'll be OK. People who give people shout outs, they'll be like, I'll give you a shout out for $50 or whatever it might be. I think it's just such a bad way to do it. If the only way you're trying to make money is by using that as like what to give people a shout out, it's just wrong. Like there's I, like for content creator stuff like that. It's just weird. I don't, I don't like that at all. So you'll probably never see me giving somebody a shout out for their YouTube channel or Twitch stream or anything like that because they gave me money. That's going to be very few and far between on my side. Okay. So if we come out here, I think we can make the little dinghy kind of sit in out at this point. We can start off with a little tiny like three by three platform and do I have any full blocks? I got a few. Let's get rid of that guy. And then to make ourselves a little bit of an engine, we're gonna have a little hopper sticking out here. And then on the back of, and then on top of the hopper, we can have a little blast furnace sticking out this way. <laughs> There's a little engine. Look at me. Can you waterlog a hopper or no? You cannot, that's a bummer. I hate that. I hate that we can't waterlog it. Hmm. Now what? That takes my plan away for what the engine was going to be. <laughs> you know, we'll make it look like it's raised up out of the water. That's a thing with engines, right? With these little dinghies is they don't, the engines don't actually sit in the water until you're um, like actually moving. So we can have him like here. So he looks like he's tipped up out of the water. Ready to go. So we got this little bit of back half of a dinghy here. Let me do this and this. We can have bam and bam. Okay, 
you turn you around? Can. Aha! There we go. You get your little thing. You know with dinghies where you just kind of hold the thing, you turn the engine, and you just and do all that stuff? Yeah, that's what we're going for. Very intelligent, I know. You just kind of go and fly off in the distance. Yep, that's. Yes, yep. I don't know. What do we all think? <laughs> Random little dinghy thing. <laughs> Then over here, I think I need to get some lanterns, but I don't, I don't, I don't know. I don't hate it. Will you build a mega base in this world? Eventually, we will have like a whole city. You're looking for like one giant, absolutely massive structure? Probably no, not so much. We got a cozy call. Oh my gosh! You should get some coral if you can. Make pretty good looking fruit barrels. Yeah, I want to go get a lot of coral. The blue coral, I think, is what you're talking about there for a little barrel of blueberries. Why are you allowed to do this? Why is that allowed? Homie, homie, please. He's like, I have no hands to climb up the ladder with. How do I go blow this person up? I don't know. All of them work. Yellow looks like bananas, red strawberry, etc. Ooh, yeah, good way, good way to go. Oh, breathe, 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 breathe. <laughs> Oopsies. Okay, I think it's time that we go find some coral. Because I want to bring a lot of coral back in here. So we'll have to figure out where the heck that coral reef is again. So today we did a lot of terraforming. We, we turned this whole face over here from being gross dirt and sands and stones into being clean stony stuff. We built a custom tree. We built a nice little dock here with some of that stuff. And we are headed off to go find some coral. Yeah, like, to this day, the favorite concerts I've ever been to was I saw Marilyn Manson. That was really cool. Uh, I saw Motley Crue. They were also really cool. Uh, and then I've also seen uh, then Skrillex. Like, those three are probably the top concerts I've been to of just, like, just really, really good concerts. Like, I didn't like Marilyn Manson at all, but he was playing at a festival that I went to when I was younger. And it was just... It was weirdly, weirdly, really good. And since then, I really, I started to enjoy his music a lot more. Weird, weird dude, but he has some good music. Do you, have you played any MMOs? I've been a really big World of Warcraft player in Shadowlands. I'm kind of bored of it right now. I, I played it for like the Mythic Plus side of the game. So the running dungeons and everything. And I just got the, I think there's Coral Ryan in front of us. Perfect, we made it. Uh, I just got the Dungeon Master, Dungeon Keystone Master achievement last week so i completed like the plus 15 dungeons all over the board and now i'm just like yeah <laughs> what did you do to it what's the other side i don't i don't think i want what did you i left it in the oven too long I just here's the, the here uh, no i know it's fine here's um everybody here's what your toast should look like when you make toast here's what my fiance's <laughs> toast looks like <laughs> You just put a lot so of butter there. on it. And I was like, watching James I Charles I... <laughs> do his makeup with only his left hand, and I was like, You can have your toes in. back. <laughs> so I felt sad and told me. It was like, it's I'll come just, talk to you about it's, it. Yeah, it's, uh, it's quite toasty. It's, uh... I sometimes like burnt toast, but I don't know. That's pretty. It doesn't even have like a crunch to it. It's just Will you full... come fight with me and we'll see no, how it is? No, I don't want it. <laughs> I don't want your toast. It would be kind of funny if it was really bad in me. No, I don't want to do that. Whatever. <laughs> YOLO. I'm gonna make you, only, you, you only toast once? Yoto? Yoto. <laughs> that was bad. <laughs> That's really bad. Maybe, maybe we don't do that. <laughs> okay, well, I was sad, so. You can go make another piece of toast. I did. I just turned it off and put it in the oven. <laughs> yep, that sounds like it. Right, you trying the toast? How is it? <laughs> it's, just, it's not good. <laughs> she didn't even bite down on it. Just, it's, no, I don't want to try it after that look. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> you can't untoast your toast, everybody. Do you have a picture without your beard? I haven't fully shaven my face since um, high school. <laughs> In high school, I went to a school that had a no facial hair policy, which really sucked. Um, and my senior year of high school, I got to the point where my beard grew, my facial hair grew so fast 
that by the end of the day, I had like full on five o'clock shadow going. And one of the teachers who I unfortunately had with the last class period of every single day um, would give you a detention if you had any facial hair on your face that he would notice. Um, and so he, I would walk into class and he'd be like, hmm, you need to shave. I'd be like, I shaved this morning. And he's like, I don't believe you. And then I think it's literally just been out of bitterness since then. I've, I've shaved twice a day for my entire senior year of high school because I, the reason being is because I had swim team practice at 5 a.m. before school. So I'd go and do that. And then by like 2 p.m. in the afternoon, it was like little tiny little like baby, baby stubbles, baby stubbles. Um, and so there's just like no hope. <laughs> Haven't shaved since high school because people told me I couldn't grow a beard. <laughs> That's the type of pettiness I strive for as well. <laughs> Do I like anime? Uh, some, some. I'm not in. I'm not interested in those super anime, anime shows. God, those don't do it for me. But some of them, like um, my fiance and I, have been watching through Sword Art Online. I'm watching again. She hasn't watched it before. Um, so we've been watching through that recently. I've been meaning to pick up Attack on Titan, but I just haven't gotten around to it yet. And then also like the best anime of all, SpongeBob is pretty cool. Watch Full Metal Alchemist. I haven't seen any of those. I've actually tried Full Metal Alchemist before and I just wasn't a huge fan, I remember, but maybe. Uh, let's go with like a dead coral, dead coral. I think if we place this right here, it's gonna die, which will look kind of cool. Honestly, if we keep that alive, that'd be really sweet, but I don't think we can unless we waterlog cobble, which we could do, but I feel like I don't really want to. Actually, do I? Let's go get some cobblestone and try. No, 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 no. We're not gonna do that. We're just gonna do a few dead coral fans around here. Call it good. I don't wanna get too crazy busy on the colors because we already have a lot of stuff happening down in this area. We'll do that. That'll be fine. All of that hard fought coral was just so we could do this. <laughs> now it's done. <laughs> Check this out though. We need to get some leaves. We need leaves. We can't leave that without leaves. We can't leave it. Ha, get it. Leave. There we go. Zodius, you already got a name, dude. Whip was just something random I came up with and it just stuck with me forever. There we go. That's looking sweet. That bamboo will grow. Everything else is going to grow. Look at this little bit. Do a nice little zoom. Look at that. They're a little bit dingy off to the side. Oh, this is the BSL shaders. Sure. I actually really like that. This little spot right here. Okay, okay, okay. Y'all y'all are gonna love this. Y'all are gonna absolutely love this. There, are we happy? Are we happy now? Oh, it's dirt behind it. We not have no that's dirt behind it. He Okay, there we go. There we go. Give me the speed. Give me the dolphin speed. Bam! Done. Did it. Nailed it. All right. Cool. I think that's where we're going to be calling it today, though, folks. I, I got to get out of here in 10 minutes or so, and I want to get some lunch before. So thank you all so very much for watching, though. That's going to have to do it today. I really appreciate uh, H-Bomb and uh, Chosen Architect, as well as Blue Jay and everybody else for the raids, and everybody stopping by, dropping all the new follows, the biddies, the donations, the uh, subs, and all that cool stuff. I really do appreciate it from all you folks. Thank you, thank you, thank you so very much for stopping by. 